The Socratic Method The Socratic Method, also known as Method of Elenchus, Elenctic Method, Socratic Debate, or Socratic Dialectic, is Socrates's way of discussing and investigating the truth of opinions. It starts with two or more sides holding different viewpoints about some subject. By using reasoned argumentation, they attempt to establish the truth. There are three main steps. First, the interlocutor, that is, the person involved in a dialogue with Socrates, gives an initial definition, or states an opinion on a topic. Then, Socrates evaluates the interlocutor's claim, pointing out any incongruity. Finally, we see an attempt to improve the definition, or give a better one. Often, by the end of the dialogue we will still not have an affirmative answer to what something truly means. However, along the way, we will come to realize at least two interesting points. First, we often don't really know what we think we know. The more we learn, the more acutely we become aware of our own ignorance. Second, more constructively, by eliminating unfounded or conflicting assumptions and beliefs, we start to form an idea of what something is not. Even though we may not be able to positively say what something is, we've narrowed down the possibilities of what something is not. Imagine, we were asked to explain rainbows, and we don't really know how to explain in terms of sunlight, rain droplets, refraction, and the electromagnetic spectrum. We are fairly certain, however, that rainbows are not bits of unicorns, or a thousand flutters of angel wings. Notwithstanding our lack of scientific terminology, we can make assertions about what rainbows are not. This is called the apophatic process. Socrates died at the age of 71, given a death sentence for, corrupting the youth, and, not believing in the gods of the city of Athens. He taught people to question authority, to question assumptions, to challenge the status quo. This did not go down well with many, who felt their power threatened by his teachings. When offered a chance to escape prison, he famously quipped that the unexamined life is not worth living. An elderly man, he would have had to spend his twilight years unable to do what he loved, what made his life meaningful. Only through the effort to examine meaningful truths, with a capital T, do our lives come to mean anything. True knowledge is the knowledge of eternal truths, knowledge of things that are perfect, unchanging ideas such as justice, virtue, and goodness. How do we understand such ideas? By reasoning with others, by talking to people, by challenging assumptions, by questioning beliefs. The Socratic method challenges our beliefs, bringing out deficiencies and inconsistencies. Faced with this, we may feel threatened at the very core of who we think we are. We may squeeze our eyes and ears shut, in denial. Or we can take Socrates' way and believe that, ultimately, our awareness of our ignorance makes us wiser than those who, though ignorant, still claim knowledge. Once again, thanks for watching. For more videos and content about philosophy, subscribe to our channel. You can also visit our website at philosophymt.com.